pregame show. Hey everybody, welcome to Ram TV and welcome to my NBA 2K19 uh, Brooklyn Nets Rebuild. Uh, this is episode 4, so if you guys aren't caught up, look for a playlist in my channel. And if you're new, subscribe and click that notification bell to be basically told whenever we come out with a new video. And if you like what you see, smash that thumbs up button. Leave any comments below. Um, I'm trying to get at least 3 to 5 likes for this video, so it would help me out a lot if you guys just click the thumbs up button. And here we are for this game against the Grizzlies. Um, we are dealing with some injuries. We got uh, uh, Larry Nass Jr. dealing with a day-to-day -day injury, as well as uh, Ronnie Hollis Jefferson. And uh, we have Jared Allen still out for another two, uh, one to two weeks. So we got Ed Davis filling in. And uh, it's going to be interesting because even against the Knicks, uh, Jared Allen was definitely a big... Uh, it, was, it, was, uh, it was a challenge only because... You know, Jared Allen's a, a, a big presence in there. I don't think Ed Davis is as good. I'm going to try to make the best out of it and try to take care of the Grizzlies here. <clears throat> and win this out. And about a minute gone here in the first quarter. Russell passes to Nance. And the chance by Larry Nance. There's a slam by the hurting Lan uh, Nance. Down he doesn't want his team to be shy offensively. Look at, look at, at, at Davis. A little the post time, game there on Powell. Uh, uh Marcus All. Doing everything they can to cut him off on his way to the hoop. Guys, uh, they've been getting it done. They came out. Come on, Fareed. And they have been still in some of those minutes. Now here is Harris. Look, Joe Harris taking it to the rim. This game is all even. Nice and aggressive. And that's what the pump fakes there for. Brooks with a screen on Carter Williams. Get that out of here. Free the block. Ronde and one. That is a foul on Chris Conley. Ed Davis gets a Ed Davis, a little spin and roof in the post. A defense. That's some good defense. The Nets. Here's oh my God! Play back off. Away, so far, they, they've really been reluctant to let it. Oh, switch! What are you doing? Oh my God! And there's a slam by Larry Nance on Gasol for the end one. And a pick and roll with Larry Nance, and he is cooking right now for the Nets. Keeping them close. Gotta turn up the burners. Maybe coming right back the other way. He was a nasty, nasty shot blocker last season. Here's Anderson. Out to Conley. Let's it go with. Oh my gosh! Offensive rebound and three another by eleven. Come on, guys. There's literally three guys underneath the basket. You guys can get the rebound. Carter Williams against Conley. Jackson a screen on Carter Williams. There's a lob to Jackson. No. Oh, come on, man. Where's the defense? Rotation. Everything is so slow for the Nets defense. So terrific. I keep the defense guessing in these sets. But it's really his positioning and, and his rotations are what make him so great. Always involved in plays, and he just seems to be Look that right in his face. Right in Gasol's face. And somehow they still score. Come on, man. You look at Michael Conley. What are you kidding me? Wow, it's time for them to switch up their defense. Conley's shot is off. Nets trail by 11. Two seconds separating the shot clock and game. Clock. And he hits Foul. And one. Let's go. That is Chris Levert converting at the basket. Bring the lead to within single digits. Temple's checked in. Now to eight. Here's Temple. He's guarded by Cram. And Temple gets to Conley. Come on. Come on, guys. Where's the rotation on defense? If someone gets caught in the pick, you switch. God, they're so slow. Okay. So that ends this game. We are on a losing streak. We lose by 14 to the Grizzlies. There's a lot. To, there's a lot of work to be done with this team. Defensively, uh, offensively, there's just when there's injuries, everything just slows down. Um, obviously, the two injuries that I have with Hollis Jefferson and 
Man, so they just can't play 100%, so they can't perform as well as they can. And then also missing Jared Allen definitely killed us here. Um, Conley, Gasol, and Temple just killed it. Look, Gasol, 14 rebounds. Usually, Jared Allen has at least put a body on him. Um, unacceptable. Uh, D'Angelo Russell only had 12 points. He had seven, seven, seven turnovers. It's some bullshit things where he loses the ball, dribbling. Um, just look at this. Not a, not a single person double-digit rebounds. At Davis, I don't know. He didn't do anything. I'm sorry. He just didn't show up. Um, just an overall lack of effort for the team. Um, couldn't hit any threes. Look at this. Six for 25 from threes. That's horrible. Um, shot 48%. Their def you know, our defense is horrible. Giving it 56%. Uh, had too many turnovers. You know, it was it was just messy overall. Not not at all happy about this. And I don't know. That's all I really have to say about that because it's it's actually infuriating because you know from what I play with with the Thunder. There you go. Uh, the of this. Okay. Serge Ibaka for the Mari Carroll. No, I'm not gonna. Oh. Uh, no, I'm not going to give a pick. Okay, let's keep pushing on. Come on, somebody heal up. All right, finally. Um, so I'm just going to fix that once before the game. Okay, so everybody is healthy now, ish. And I think this can be a lot better for the team. Because I, I'm going to be real with you, Ed Davis can't be a uh, starter. I'm sorry. He's just not, he's just not starter material. And uh, I'm gonna fix the fix the lineups here. But I'm gonna see if I could, who I can actually get for like a guy like Ronnie Hollister, who I don't use that much. You know, he's just there, and I'm trying to improve the team overall as well as get some youth movement going, which is what exactly what we're doing. Um, so I can get get Brooke Lopez. Jalen Morris, but I already have a big man. Unless I could double them up. Um, that actually seems a little tempting because I love post players, and that's about exactly what Brooke Lopez is. Um, let's see, they're both on, they're all in one year contracts, so that really won't hurt me too much. I could resign them if I wanted to. Jordan Clarkson, that eh, makes a bit too much money. Uh, Markeith Morris, Patrick Beverly, Kyle Anderson, Alex Lynn, Alenic, Kurt Gilchrist, Buddy Heald, Brandy Lee. Uh, well, this doesn't seem too bad. Let's see. Boyan Bogdanovich. I'm not gonna give up. I'm not gonna give up a pick. Search. No. All right. I might actually pull the, I might pull the trigger on this trade, um, because Jalen Morris is a free agent as well as Brook Lopez after the season. Um, I don't really do much with Ronnie Hollis Jefferson, to be honest. Um, I don't like, you know, I just can't play with him correctly. So I'm gonna pull this trade off. I'm gonna welcome back Brook Lopez to the Nets, and then we're gonna fix the minutes here, um, and we're just gonna move things around. I'm happy to have Brook Lopez back, only because. Okay, I'm, a, I'm actually a Brook Lopez fan. Uh, but this helps things, you know. Uh, let's see, uh, Davis. So, we're going to have... We're going to play Brook on 30 minutes. Hello, everybody. I'm sorry. We're going to cut your minutes a little bit. And we're going to put Jared Allen in there. Uh... Jared Allen, where is he? Okay, so we're gonna put around 25 minutes. Larry Nance, don't worry, you're gonna be my, you're gonna be my, uh, he's gonna be my sixth, sixth man. Carl Williams, gonna play at least a few minutes. All right, let's organize this thing. Okay. All that mumbo jumbo. Well, while, while I fix this, I'm gonna wrap it up here. Hope you guys enjoy this uh, NBA 2K19 uh, Nets rebuild. It's gonna be a little rough. 
But uh, again, if you like what you saw, click the thumbs up button. Leave any comments below. Um, we're going to try to get this new look, well, kind of new look Nets with Brooke Lopez back in black and white. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, click the thumbs up button. Hope you guys have a great day. Take it easy and peace.